Ahoy, you scurvy dogs. If you have not heard yet, my channel is for late teens and adults. If you're under the age of 13, this channel and content is not for you. Now, one of the ways that you can help me gain power to overthrow the great and evil overlord named Coppa is consider subscribing to my channel. The more power I have, the more influence I have, and the more influence I have, the overlord will not stand a chance. So make sure to hit that subscribe button. And if you're feeling super generous, hit that notification bell as well. Now, enjoy this adventure. Ahoy mateys! You might be wondering why I'm standing here playing this song with a random pirate. Well my friends, this tale is a tale of two thieves. And this is how we got here. This tale starts like any good tale, with the ship parked perfectly at Crooked Mast and a galleon over at the local fort. Well, I decided to pay my respects to this poor galleon crew before I started my long swim over to find a good hiding spot. Along the way, I got bit by a rather big shark, and when I decided to fight it, there were two sharks after me. Probably due to all my cursing of the whale lord, and well, he sent two sharks to send me to my grave. However, I gained a bit of information here on the ferry. Listen here. Oh, you scurvy dogs. Nick Gaming Y214. Do you like me on your ship, bruh? On a, a ship, a gal? What are you talking about? Get back to your ship, you scurvy dog. With this bit of new information, I knew that the galleon crew would definitely be on edge and that possibly another pirate might be trying to sneaky sneak them. So I made my second attempt on the swim, but this time, this time, I made it to my favorite fort. Climbed up the ladder and, well, I looked for a little hiding spot to maybe tuck myself into. And this is when things get rather interesting. Upon listening into their conversations, I determined that this crew was probably and most likely an open crew galleon attempting to do the fort. But what I did not know is that there was another person doing a sneaky sneak on this island. There was the first one we met on the ferryman, but then there was this new character named Dova. And he, my friends, was trolling this galleon crew. Teasing them as to where he was, asking for truces and all sorts of different things. At one point they asked him where he was and Dova in fashion replied, I'm on the island. This is when I knew that I would probably like this sneaky sneak pirate and I wanted to see how this all played out. Being safely tucked on my tower I knew I was perfectly safe so I just wanted to see what would happen. At one point, they asked him if he was invisible, and I didn't quite know how to handle that one. After a while, this open crew galleon finally found where Dova was hiding and apparently chased him into the ocean where he decided to swim underwater. Still asking for a truce, trying to distract these poor pirates, he made his way over to the tower that I was in. It was at that point that the open crew galleon and the player nomad clearly have had enough of the shenanigans from Dova and they all went after his life. So I decided to re-tuck into this position hoping that no one would come up to the tower but as luck would have it Dova decided to climb into my tower and hide. And he did not see me. I mean he just stood there. I know I'm good at sneaky sneaks, but this takes it to a whole new level as I just laid there and watched this pirate try to hide. I mean, he's a thief, so among thieves I have some major respect for this pirate, but still, what was he trying to do? He started to clap, and then he started to point. I mean, I'd, I knew what I had to do. If he decided to use this tower to hide, I would have to end this poor pirate's life. There was, after all, only room for one proper sneaky sneak, and I was the pirate to do it. 
It was in that moment that I knew what I had to do. I had to blundy poor Dovo right in the face, probably scaring the absolute crap out of him, as he had no idea Kids, I was even reason. in that tower. So I went back to hiding, hoping that they didn't hear what I just did to poor old Dova. Yeah, he's in this tower over here. He just jumped out the tower. Where is he? I think you know that. He saved us. What? Get that light, though. There's still a mermaid here, though, guys. He's still here. Like now, how these pirates did not see me, I will never know, but by the blessed way, Lord, I was able to secretly hide right under their noses. They eventually decided to leave the tower thinking that I had been killed, well, sorry, Dova had been killed by a shark. Unbeknownst to them, I was the one that actually blundered him right in the face. Now, this poor crew seemed to have some disagreements between them, and, well, let's just listen in. Pull the power from the back of the box. Stop. From the back of the terror box. Pull the power cord. No, the Xbox is on the TV. It's got your game downloaded to it. Do you just not want to play the game today? No. It's not gone. It drops wherever you are. Okay, well, how am I supposed to? I was in the night you were playing. Okay. I love you. I think you're just angry at the world today. This poor pirate had no idea how angry he would be at the world. After five minutes or so, the galleon decided to leave the fort. I was very confused by this move. It seemed like they sent one person over to go sail the ship while the others stayed on the island fighting all the ways of the skellies. Eventually though, they all died, so I took that opportunity to find a new hiding spot on the island. One of my favorites for this fort is all the way on the top as you get a great view of everything and kind of see what's all going on. So I ran past Two-Faced Man and went all the way to the top. Now that we're all caught back up, let's see how this tale Ooh, finishes. Ooh, that was a... I think it's Skull. Skull Keep. Dang, that was a beautiful shot by the Skelly Tower. <laughs> right onto the deck of the sloop. Probably knocked the guy off. Oh, that was another good one. They might knock the mast down. Question is, where is he going to go? This is the same Probably fella. Probably sadly towards me. Dude, this guy Four might be coming people. up to the, the tower here. Don't take, don't ruin my spot, bro. Did you not learn the first time? <laughs> well, at least then you can find out his name and send him a message. Just like, did you clearly not learn your lesson? Damn it. It's definitely the same guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. For something just oh, today. Gosh. Stupid skeleton lord is like knocking me standing up. He blew me off the island. This is rude. I stuck in the spot. You stuck, no man. I'm not stuck. All right, Pally. They just they just killed them just okay. now. Okay, I think I think we need to bring bring the ship to Isle of Last Words, and we will we will plot our our attack there. So just just bring it around to the island. Just a moment, to open oh, it, on. make sure the clutch. Should... What are they doing? The ship is so far away from the fort. There's someone just launched to try to catch it. All right, they just opened the door. Oh my goodness, these fools! What are they doing? All right, get the sloop here. All right, I'm gonna get in position here. Oh, they said not to. <laughs> they said not to load the mega keg on the ship. That's fine. That's fine. I will grab we'll the mega the keg and I will use it again. All right, they're talking. Uh, hold on, hold on. It looks like they're just loading, loading up. Okay, they're parking. They just dropped the anchor on the galleon. 
So I think if you approach the fort from the south, you'll be able to distract them for me. What are they doing? All right, yeah, yeah. Good job, good job. That's a good angle. All right. Yeah, get in position. All right, as soon as as soon as you shoot, I'm going to uh, grab the mega keg, but uh, I'm going to wait for you to distract him here first. I'm getting into a position where I can. Perfect. All right, I'm just hiding. I'm wait. Oh. I think that's a mess. <laughs> that's all right. Oh no, that was their main. That oh was their nice, mess. I see it there. All right, good job, good job. All right, I got Ooh, the mega and keg. I got a hit marker. Good job distracting them, Pally. Okay, I'm, I got the keg. Oh, oh that was beautiful for a firebomb. <laughs> it looks so good. Good shot, All right. Pally. All right, yeah, yeah. Just to keep distracting them. I'm gonna, I'm gonna blow them up here with a mega keg. I just hit their back. Good job. I'm in the water right now. Okay. All right, about, uh, about to board here. Just detonated. All right, I'm gonna take this keg down below. <laughs> All right, the, the fuse is lit, and uh, they, they are going to go down. Then, oh. <laughs> I got the mega keg. Shit. Aw. Yeah, one guy threw a firebomb on me. Dude. Yep, on it. Who do you think you're talking to? I would hope so. Why are we unanchored? Uh, one's at least in water, I know that. Mm. Alright, kill one. Alright, he's coming right behind you. Yep. Drop the anchor there. Yep. I'm shooting him in the back. Down the uh, port side in the water. Alright, he's dead. Done. Aww. I know. Alright, let's get this treasure. Let's harpoon it. I'm gonna bring it to the edge. You just start harpooning. Uh, we got some treasure. Oh man, we got. It. Yeah. Do you need help turning? Uh. Right now. I'm gonna put the other stuff here. Killed two. I think that's all of it. Really? Put a uh, firebomb, but it wasn't my intended target. I was intending the back of the ship, not the mast. No, I just let's. I'm gonna talk to him. I think this is the guy that's doing the sneaky sneak. All right. Matey, matey, can you hear me? You scurvy sloop. Were you doing the sneaky sneak? Hey, matey, matey, come, come to the center of the fort here. I've killed the galleon. I've killed the galleon. We've taken all the good treasure. Come here, come here to the center of the pond here. Let's have, let's have an accord. Matey, can you hear me? Just, just acknowledge that you can hear me here. There's some treasures left here for you. Bloody friggin' key. I'll leave it here for you since, uh, you know, sloppy seconds. You know what I'm saying here? Oh, that ain't right. You're not gonna see that treasure. I promise you, it's not gonna happen. Come here, come here. Stop it! Come back here. All right, is he, is he going after us? Seriously? Oh, he bang. came back. He turned around. Oh dang! That sloop is getting destroyed right now. Woohoo! It's like we it's like we made him pick a fight. We're not even the ones. I don't think they got the treasure yet. I don't know, I don't know if that guy had enough time to get it all either. Like maybe a villainous. They rolled too. up quick then. Oh gosh, the shot is beautiful. Yeah, there's some on the uh the sloop right now. Okay. Or on the eastern so... part. He had Time to get one bill in this call. <laughs> hey, mate, are, are you here? You, the one that was doing the sneaky sneak. Hey, what's up, dude? No, 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 I'm not with a galleon. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Can you hear me?
from one thief to another. <laughs> oh, come on. That was out. All right, we're going to let this guy join us. We're going to swim it out. Drop the anchor if you can. <laughs> Honor among thieves, boys. Oh, don't worry. The man who can teleport back may or may not be uh, causing some fun. Oh, boyos. Boyos, boyos, boyos. They may or may not be burning now. <laughs> no, they did. I may or may not have jumped off the ship and launched some fireballs. <laughs> Is that why they're on fire? <laughs> yes. <laughs> and because they have blunderbusses, they know they can't shoot me. Oh, wow. One is that determined, huh? When our pineapples combined, we're the thieves of the sea. Everyone, put your pineapples in. We shall make an unholy make fruit. An unholy fruit. <laughs> Fire! 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 Ah, oh, that hit us. Mm. Alright, I'm gonna get fur board here. I'm definitely boarding. They are quite on fire. I'm certain this guy's like, dude, this is hilarious. <laughs> oh gosh, I'm off. Don't worry, we're swinging about. Yeah, I got him distracted right now. Yeah, they're burning pretty good. <laughs> oh, oh, this is marker. such a cheating thing. I love it. Oh I my gosh, so dude. I got another pineapple in here. I'll take that. They're about to be done, they got it. Yeah, they're about to be done. Two dead. Oh my gosh. Uh. And that, my friends, is the tale of two thieves and how I got to get to know Dovakin. What a great thief he was. We eventually got him into our Discord and I had to apologize for blundering him in the face. Dude, Dude you're standing just, right I'm... on top of me. I'm like, okay, what's he gonna do? Is he gonna jump out of the tower and run? And then you lay down. I'm like, all right, I gotta do it. I gotta kill him. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was trying to Evo to like get the third person perspective to see around where they were because I, I saw one of them. I saw you were pointing. <laughs> yeah, I was just pointing at the wall so I could see because they were swimming after me at first and then I guess they lost me. I don't know how they lost me. He was Dude. right behind. 